What's up everyone, today I want to take you through some of the puzzles that I solved today and the first puzzle isn't surprisingly hard but it has a very nice uh, idea the idea is that you have time this is the idea that you most of the time have in chess so look at the position of the pieces the idea is the idea of the um, solution basically is somehow bring the queen to here and deliver mate but it takes time, right? You should move the knight, bring the queen there or there, and then deliver mate. And black doesn't watch you. But you have time. You can enforce black to play reactively. So what does it mean? It means that first move, you want to move the knight and bring the queen out, right? Where to put the knight? Right. Put it in an attacking position. Black defends the position place that queen was able to go in but then you can say that okay i'm okay with winning exchange so i just win the exchange that's it that's it so simple right 2900 and it was so simple right let's see how does the um, burritos and puzzle looks like so this was a little bit trickier than the previous one. First thing comes in mind you see the queen there and you say ah, i will give a check here and kill the king but then what you give a check king goes down to g2 and you may also saw that you have this check after that but then then what king is in g2 and then what king goes to h2 and you are running out of check what nah, suggest this Suggests that first of all this queen move is wrong. <laughs> this is obvious, but suggests that the most important square for white's king is actually g2 and we should block that because white king look at the white king. White king is a stuck on f file, cannot move around the f file, cannot go to g file except g2. It can go to the e file, but of course mm, somewhere like e2. Of course, e2 is not a very pleasant score to be in. So, what does it mean? It means that we should block the g2 square, right? And of course, you know how to do that. Here, you have the idea of queen takes a pawn, but then takes the knight. But on the other hand, you see this beautiful bishop can deliver a nice check, right? And here, you shouldn't... Mm, hurry you shouldn't take with the queen of course you should be careful and take with the bishop why taking with the queen is bad if you take with the queen again mm, uh, sorry yeah here if you take with the queen then king can run and again can go to the beautiful g2 square and escape this was the whole plan land to prevent to go to g2 square but if you take with the bishop then this is a textbook mate right i mean you can go wherever you want to deliver mates right you can go there there whatever you can move the bishop anywhere and then deliver mate so let's go to the third puzzle of a day one of the puzzles i felt uh, i admit that i felt again this puzzle is also puzzle that suggests you that you have time don't worry you have time all the time in the world so what does it mean of course the difficulty here is that black is queening the h pawn and it is not easy to stop it unless you grab this bishop right but then uh, then black can either uh, bring the rook to the the other rook to the g file and says that next move I want to mate you and then you should go to reactive um, position I will show you after the after the game so taking this bishop is wrong but but you always have time pieces um, are equal number of pieces are equal but we are down exchange and if we win the bishop we are up a piece right without losing the game of course what can you see is that we have a knight and we don't want to lose this knight where to put it yes easy square give a double check prevent black from 
taking the knight or doing anything except moving the king now take the bishop okay what was the plan of putting knight there this knight blocked the other rook from going to the g file so now we can take this and rook takes but it's too late because yeah we won i just want to show you um, the thing i discussed if you take this too early the other rook goes there and yeah you can deliver a check then then what you should uh, stop mating attack and to in order to do that you can have to move the bishop away there is basically not a, no other good option you could also move the pawn first of all you lose the rook of course you take back the rook but you lose the bishop and second of all that is that the h pawn is pushing a steal i mean you, know, you win win and this edge um, the queen is, uh, even comes in and the edge pawn is also pushing the computer says it's the rowish but if human plays most likely human vs human most likely black wins so let's go to the puzzle that i failed i failed because i was too greedy again the idea is that yeah today team <laughs> the theme of today is like you have time <laughs> all the time uh, i was thinking too much about pushing this pawn let me tell you pushing this pawn, so uh, calculated a lot of crazy things and the puzzle is rated relatively high right here is 1256 so i was thinking pushing this pawn then the knight goes back but then i noticed that oh my rook is blocking here imagine by some miracle i was able to grab this rook then it is made beautiful made right and it's very difficult to stop this mate but to in order to age of this mate i went to the wrong pass i don't want to discuss it easy pass is just say that okay please grab my queen says no now you have time to push the pawn because if knight comes back this is where and this puzzle was tricky when knight comes back you still can push the pawn and queen it if it takes you still have time to simply capture it and black cannot capture your queen because still it's a mate now you win material so let me show you why black couldn't capture it so we give a check push push captures captures and here captures is a mate right I mean can't do much right so that's it that's it so next puzzle let's go to the next puzzle next puzzle yeah this puzzle is I, I, I think it is much lower rated than it uh, than, uh, than its actual value actually so first of all uh, you may think that okay no you don't think that i can grab this pawn because it is defended multiple times so it's mm, there is no way to grab that pawn. but what other thing we can see is that if we if were able to give a check without losing the rook then it was a mate so queen can support the rook to deliver this check the weakness of this puzzle is that queen has only one place to support and this is this is square after uh, we support like this then we can give a check king goes up here here is somehow continuation is easy to see but what i want to say is that queen at a5 is very important because blocks the d eight because at this point okay i should uh, complete the puzzle and then we give a check and there is no way to uh, stop us from uh, delivering you know, either mate or winning uh, a lot of material let me tell you what i am talking about here gives check goes there gives check goes there no we have time to bring the uh, rook in it doesn't have time to escape because yeah it's mate right i mean oh sorry no this takes but what i wanted to say earlier was that 
this square was very crucial because if rook was giving check and we were take with the rook then was able to take with this pawn but unfortunately the reason that puzzle is lower rated is that basically you don't have any other square to go if it wasn't this pawn probably it was more interesting because you can't go there right because queen captures and then then what you're basically done so there is no other square to support the rook and this is the reason that is low rated and this idea of rook going to back rank is somehow obvious if you may play many puzzles and many games this is somehow obvious you want to deliver mate in back rank and then then white has a very bad position it's not easy to defend it and you have lots of lots of check with three aggressive heavy pieces so that was for today i hope you enjoyed see you next time